No use for a paralyzed Saiyan! Your dead white! He's a psycho! He, he, he just killed his own partner for no reason! Both of you need to get back to Kame House where it's safe! No, he's right. You saw what that other Saiyan can do. If we stick around, we'll only be getting in your dad's way. Sorry, Gohan. This guy's stronger than I thought he'd be. We've lost enough. I can't lose you two either. Okay. I understand, Dad. Let's finish this someplace else! Fine by me. Makes no difference. Okay, this spot should do. From what I can tell, there's no people or animals nearby. Interesting. Of all the places on your planet, you chose this as your grave site. <laughs> you should feel lucky. Not every low-class warrior gets the chance to spar with a super elite like myself. Not long after Saiyans are born, their skills as a soldier are tested. The scum whose scores are ranked the lowest are sent to the outer worlds, where the opponents are weak, much like you were, Kakarot. In other words, you were cast out like a dog. Yes, and as a result, I was lucky enough to come here to Earth. I'm grateful for that. Besides, even a lower class outcast can surpass an elite if he puts his mind to it. <laughs> it's a nice attempt at a joke. Now let me show you a wall that you will never have the ability to scale through effort alone! Open and mix! Huh? What was that? What are you planning? You really should have never gotten rid of your tail, Kakarot. But now you'll learn firsthand what a Saiyan is really capable of. Did you feel that? There's a tremendous energy and it's swelling up even bigger. I don't think it's my dad's energy we're sensing, is it? Something's wrong. I'm going back there. Go on, hold up. I'm going too. Wait. <laughs> don't blink, Kakarot. These will be your final moments before I crush you. Am I losing my mind? He turned into a giant monkey! This is crazy! How do I fight this thing? <sighs> Since when were we dealing with a hundred foot tall monster? Only choice now is to gather energy from all over the earth and make a spirit bomb! Okay, I 
think I put enough distance between us. now. Why would you kill your own partner? <laughs> because I wouldn't be caught dead associating with someone who would be taken down by such low-class warriors. You really get on my nerves. You ought to show some more respect to others than that. 
Respect? Huh. You're a poor excuse for a Saiyan. enough that Chouts' paralysis is working! Okay, this is our chance, guys! We did, but I don't have much left in me after all that. <laughs> he put up a good fight, but we were more than prepared for him. <gasps> the the Saiyan! Don't worry, Gohan. He can't hurt you now. You were the worst enemy we ever faced. But I guess the least we can do is give you a burial. Who's burying whom? Namekian, what do you hope to do with such little? Mm -hmm. Now, Piccolo! D Special Beam Cannon! Goku back to life with the Dragon Balls. And the next time we meet, you're going down for good! Too bad. I have no use for a paralyzed Saiyan. You're dead white! Uh, he's a psycho! He... 
just killed his own partner for no reason! We have to face facts. This other one is way out of our league. Forgive me, guys, but I want to face off against him one-on-one! -on -one. Goku? I get you. Let him have this, Tien. You said it yourself. He's too strong for us to even be able to lend a hand. Yeah, but... Yo! Let's finish this someplace else! Fine by me makes no difference. Now, allow me to show you a wall that no amount of hard work will help you climb! Now you're dead! First open and mix! Thank you, Chaozu! Good thing you had those sensor beans on you! But... Tien! Krillin! Uh. Oh, gonna revive your friend again? Or have you learned to let the weak stay dead? Maybe now you understand what it means to be a Saiyan, Kakarot! Damn! I'm all out of sensor beans! Well then, it's time for me to conclude this battle. And you'll be reunited with your friends in one more painful moment. What? Dead. The Dragon Balls are gone. And Krillin! He's already been killed once and can never be revived again! I will never, ever forgive you for this! How can I be reduced to this? It's inconceivable! I never want to see you on this planet again! And I shall never forget this humiliation! My, my words, Kakarot. I too will surpass the limits of what a Saiyan can do! Dragon Balls, so we can wish back Mr. Piccolo and the others. You got it, Gohan. Wait! Please don't run away! Eek! It's okay. I'm not gonna eat you or anything. Huh? Hey! Who, who the hell are you? Are you with him? Those must be the Namekian Dragon Balls I saw on my radar. They're way huger than the ones on Earth. 
If you're after these, then you must be with him. Who's him? What do you mean? Get him! Energy. Vegeta! With Frieza out of the way, my fight is with you now, Kakarot! Now become a Super Saiyan immediately! What do you think, Kakarot? Now I too can transform into the legendary Super Saiyan! <laughs> oh, I see. This little guy's an Amekian. To bring everyone back to life. I have no choice but to take down Vegeta! What are you waiting for? Turn Super Saiyan! Or would you rather just lay down and die? <laughs> Is this what you wanted? <laughs> Indeed! For killing you in this state is the only way to reclaim my honor! I pushed myself to the verge of death to improve my strength. But despite my greatest efforts, I knew deep down that I still hadn't reached your level. But then, out of the endless rage invoked by the humiliation you left me after our last battle, I became a Super Saiyan and killed Frieza with my own two hands! So I thank you, Kakarot. Well, now that you've achieved this strength, what do you even need the Dragon Balls for? Why bother killing innocent people like the Namekians? Simple, because the universe has no room for the weak. So why don't you join me? Nothing will be out of your grasp. What do you say, Kakarot? I have everything I could ever need, Vegeta. Damn it all! Even as a Super Saiyan, I'm still inferior to this low-class clown! To truly be a Super Saiyan... You've got to be pure of heart, awakened by fury. That's what I am. Your rage alone helped you reach the transformation, but you still lack what it takes to unlock its real power. If you're taking your leave, you had better finish me off this time! Oh, I'm not killing you. And no, it's not to make you feel any sense of shame. What? It's because I want to fight with you again someday. So the next time you feel ready, you can bet I'll be ready too. Kakarot, you're a true Saiyan after all. Then the next time we cross paths, I'll be stronger. Strong enough to crush you once and for all! And so, Goku and Vegeta's Super Saiyan rematch comes to an end. Our hero looks on as his newfound rival takes his leave of planet Namek. Goku triumphantly returns home to Earth to celebrate with his family and friends. Their world now at peace. As Goku continues to improve himself, one must wonder, how much stronger will he become? Only time and his next challenge will tell.